This bill would offer a new option for a parent who wants to voluntarily give up their newborn baby safely. NBC 15 Tyler Peters, Peters joins us now and Tyler, this bill would give that parent 100% anonymity. Under Wisconsin's current safe haven law, the parent must surrender their newborn baby to authorities within 72 hours and in person. With this proposed bill, the parent would not have to go through this process face to face. And it will save lives and give parents, mom and dad, an option if they feel like they are in distress. State Representative Ellen Shutt is the co-author of a bill that gives a parent the option to surrender their newborn anonymously. You might be giving it up for any number of reasons and you want to keep that private. This is made possible through a safety device called baby boxes. The parent can place the infant in the electronically monitored box and once the door is shut, the box automatically calls 911. From there, a designated fire station or hospital will retrieve the child within minutes. We've all heard the news stories where babies have been left in a dumpster. Um, and the safe haven, the intent of the safe haven bill is to ensure that someone who finds themselves in such an a unfortunate circumstance um, knows that there are safer options. Hospitals like Unity Point Health Meritors say they're ready for the change if the bill passes. We feel very well prepared. I think should this legislation um, pass, it will just further reinforce what we've already known was the right thing to do for quite some time. While the bill hasn't passed yet, it has received bipartisan support from Wisconsin lawmakers. There are members on both sides who have signed on as co-authors, and so um, we'll see going forward. And the bill passed the state Senate and will now go through the state assembly. If the bill passes, Wisconsin would become the 15th state to allow baby boxes. In the newsroom, Tyler Peters, NBC 15 News. Tyler, thank you. And we wanted to compare Wisconsin's safe haven laws to other parts of the country. We found all 50 states have the law, but they're enforced in different ways. We focused on the age limit. Wisconsin is one of a handful of states where the child can be no older than three days old. It varies in other parts of the country. These are Midwestern states like Wisconsin. Michigan has a three day old limit. Minnesota is seven. Illinois, 30. Iowa has the highest in the nation, allowing a child to be surrendered up to 90 days after they're born.